Yo, what is good people? I go by the name of Killer BZ, and today we are here with a Seven Deadly Sins video, man. Uh, for those of you who don't know, man, I've been playing this game from probably about a month after it was released. Uh, this is the global version, by the way. I don't play the JP version. So, um, yeah, man, we've been grinding a lot. I'm a free-to-play player as well, uh, so we haven't bought any gems. We haven't bought any um, cosmetics or anything like that, right? So, uh, one of the things that I wanted to show you guys right now is... I'm at a point, let me just show you my, I, I don't know if I have Eskimo's gear equipped, right? I don't have Eskimo's gear equipped, okay. So I, I do have a gear set for Eskimo. let me just see if I can find it. I believe it's, it's actually, it's currently on my Green King. So this is my first full set of SSR gear. So what I, what I done, let me see if I can compare it to another character for you. What I done was, let's see, go top. So what I did, right, was... I did the normal, I had all my R gear on the right hand side, my SSR gear on the left, and as you can see, see I still need to awaken this piece of gear here, and, and re-roll some as well, um, but as you can see, I literally have had that for a while, Only mainly because I haven't had the resources to work on making the right side of my gear SSR, right, until now. Now, thanks to this current event that is going on at the moment, um, with regards to um if you go over here to diane uh you got the salvage event that's happening right now this salvage event has been massive for me so i've done some already and as you can see i have 61 five star blue stones i've used some like i said i've showed you guys that sorry excuse the beep i've showed you guys that um i like i said so I, I've used some already, like, you know, I showed you guys that I've now worked on Eskinor's for SSR gear, right? So now I need to complete, uh, how many is it? I need to obviously do three more full sets for my other three characters that I'm going to be using, right? And um, I have a lot. I mean, one of the tips that I'll give you, I got this tip from uh, Cynic Alex. So big shout out to, to Alex, who is my uh, knighthood leader. Uh, big shout out to you, bro. So what... What we've been doing is at the moment while this event is on you want to make sure you're doing as much farming for ssr gear as possible uh, for me i'm a free to play um, i'm free i'm a free to play player so i can literally i just do it every time my stamina is full right, so every time my stamina is full i'll go in and i'll do a run and like you know it, i think it takes 80 stamina right it's, it's 10 stamina per stage right so you just run it eight times it's 80 stamina and then once your stamina uh, replenishes above 80 you do it again rinse and repeat rinse and repeat right you can use stamina pots if you want to um i do have stamina pots i try and save my stamina pots for farming books uh, every other week so um for me i, I like i said i've done a massive i i've done a lot of this already which is why i have so much five star um awakening stones already but this is what you generally want to do so it's one of two things right so you even want to be grinding this uh, grinding the SSR gear, coming over, obviously plus uh, I plus five everything. So I'll show you. I, I got loads more to get rid of. At the moment, I've equipped it all on my characters, and we'll go into that in a sec. Uh, which is the tip that I got from Cynic Alex. So again, big shout out to you, my bro. But yeah, so what um, I would advise, especially free to play players, is either grind your SSR gear, and as you're grinding the gear, you're gonna plus five it, bring it over to Diane, and and sell it. Or you can do that. Or you could go over to here if you've got a load of amount of gold. You can go over to here. You can go over here, just filter it. So I've got mine set to if it's anything between grade C to SR, it automatically salvages it. And if it's SSR, I keep it right. So you could go over there. I've spent about 25 to 30 million doing this. So, um, <laughs> yeah. It's quite a lot of gold, but there's, I mean, when you get to a point where you've got a lot of gold and whatnot, this is what you want to be using your gold for. I never understood why people said it before, but I, I get it now. But this is what you want to be using your gold for um, because it helps you, man. It helps boost up your CC so much if you can get the resources um, to obviously build up your SSR gear, right? So what you want to do is once you've got a load of SSR gear and you go through the long-winded process of plus five in it all, what you want to do at the moment is what i'm doing is again this is the tip that we got from cynic alex is you want to equip it onto your characters so what i've done is i've got loads so let's just go through the escanor 
Uh, Escanor's got his proper gear set on, but if we go to the next person, they haven't got any SSR gear. But then we've got this person, right? So he has SSR gear. So this one is a new piece of SSR gear that I've been working on for another one of my characters. But uh, then you've got obviously this piece that's plus five. Uh, that be I think they're quite good rolls. No, they're not good rolls. Okay, I don't know why I've got that padlock then. I need to take the padlock off. I thought they were good rolls, but yeah, they're not. <laughs> so we'll be salvaging them. So, you know, these ones I'll be salvaging. Um, this one's quite a good roll. So uh, I'm obviously going to keep that piece there. But that, again, plus five, plus five. So all I've literally done is like all the SSR gear that I've got, I've just kind of, again, uh, Diane had another piece on her. So like I've literally, all the SSR gear um, that I've got, I've literally just been plus five in. I, I think it, it took me about an hour. But I, I finally done it all, right? So there's going to be some pieces that I keep for my actual team. But then there's going to be others that I'm going to salvage, right? So for me, I'm I'm way away reaching 1.5 million, 1.75 million, and 2 million, right? So that's way out of my reach. But I'm not too far away from 1.25 million. So for me, I won't salvage my SSR gear just yet. I'm probably still going to grind and i'm still gonna equip ssr gear on the characters that are in my roster i'm still gonna also be um leveling up and evolving characters which will help me get over that 1.25 mark right and it will give me that extra 3.5 percent i think at the moment i've got the extra three percent but it will give me the extra 0.5 percent and the thing is every little makes a difference yeah the thing is the way I look at this is like you're doing this stuff anyway. You're grinding SSR gear. Whether that means you're grinding the stages to get the SSR gear or you're grinding for the gold and then you're using the gold to open the chest to get the SSR gear. Either way, you're grinding for SSR gear. And if you're not, you should be, right? And then on top of grinding the SSR gear, you're also going to be plus five in it all. And then you're going to salvage it anyway. Whether you salvage it now or whether you salvage it towards the end of the salvage event, it... it, it it, you're not going to benefit in any kind of way by salvaging it now besides the fact that you'll be able to work on your SSR gear quicker. I I would personally advise that if you're going to be going through the grind and whatnot anyway, just equip it on all your characters, you know, push up to whatever next milestone you can get up to in here. And then once you get to that next milestone, then you just salvage it all because once you hit this hit one mark if your cc drops below that it doesn't get removed it will still remain on your on your account so um so for me i'm gonna get to this 1.25 mark um and then once i get to there and i unlock this and it's applied to my account then i'm literally just gonna salvage the materials and then once i start salvaging the materials then i'll be able to work on my star game man so um it's, it's definitely something i'm 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 excited about man because my cc outside of let me just look my cc if i go to my my hood i believe i believe my cc uh does it tell me here no it doesn't tell me. Oh, oh hold on tell me here right so, okay so my cc th this isn't an accurate reading right okay but it tells you at the bottom registered combat class 158 so my cc at the moment with Escanor with full this isn't the team that i use by the way but um the with Escanor with his full SSR set, and then the other three with half of SSR set, um, that's my max combat class, uh, 158. This used to be a team that I used, but I've now replaced uh, Blue Ellie Hawk with... Um, I've now replaced Blue Ellie Hawk with uh, Red Hellbrim, and then I've replaced Arthur with uh, Green Merlin. So, um, so, yeah, so with that being said... I want to see how much of a difference it makes and what we'll probably do is we'll do another video um later on down the line where we've actually able to salvage everything and once we salvage everything we'll create the ssr gear we'll equip it on the team and we'll see how much of a boost it was in cc uh, for our team i'm looking forward to that i'm hoping it takes me really close to like the 165 170 mark i don't know how much of a boost it will give my cc I'm really hoping it will take me to the like 170 mark. That would be nice. That would be nice, man. Because then I'll be re then I'll be ready for gear PVP. I'll be ready. But then I guess so would everybody else that's grinding this event anyway. But um, but yeah, let me know what you guys thoughts are. Let me know what you guys are doing at the moment and what you're prioritizing in the game. I absolutely love this event. I think the um the 100 uh the 100 days 
event it has been absolutely amazing for me like i said i'm free to play so you know going into things like this and going into the bingo i think we're on so we're on uh so we've done two of these fully already um and like you know getting all these things like you know look i got 184 anvils i had two anvils at the start of this event we got 184 that's amazing um like you know we, we got a load of wings we got a load of um ears i think we got even more um got even more horns like it's just been it's just been crazy like the event has been absolutely crazy we've even got like we got 24 hammers as well yo it's just insane we got 13 ssr pendants like so as a free to play player yo i'm loving this i'm loving this man it's like free rewards everywhere can't complain it's a bit of a grind but the grind is so rewarding that you don't feel like you're grinding for nothing you know so yeah i'm absolutely loving that um just to show you guys my roster as well because i haven't really showed you guys too much but uh, let's just put it in order of uh, levels here i've got some i've got some big boy like what i've done is like i've prioritized because I, I love playing pvp i've prioritized the units that i love to use in pvp and then i've kind of prioritized like units that i use in demon fights just to speed up the fights quicker because you know no one wants to be in a demon fight for 15 20 minutes and then you do it with a random and then you fail and then you gotta go in again yeah so uh so I've, I've maxed out those units but i've had so many i think before i maxed out those units i had like over 25 ssr pendants I was just like, dude, why not? These units are at level 70 anyway. Let me just, you know, a couple of SSR pendants is what it is. And, uh, and then again, obviously, we've used a lot of SSR pendants. We went down to about six and then we're back up to like over 10. So we're doing well. We're doing well, man. But, uh, but you know, as you can see here, uh, you know, I've got quite a few decent units. Nothing crazy. I think that there's only a few that I'm missing. I think out of all the ones that I'm missing, the ones that really rub me is probably Blue Demon Melee, man. I wish I got Blue Demon Melee, man. But I wasn't prepared for him. I'd spent a load of the gems that I was grinding for on Cosmetics. And I, I really regret it. I really regret doing that, man. Um, but it is what it is. It is what it is. The gems are gone now. We've got to stack up again. I just bought the... Um, I just bought the weapons for Escanor. I just bought the weapon for Escanor. And the weapon for um, Red Demon Meliodas. And obviously Blue Demon Meliodas whenever I get him. Uh, because the pierce rate on the the weapons are so high it's like how can you not get them you know uh when you look at the pierce like seven percent bro that's insane so i I couldn't pass on them i had to spend 60 gems but you know now we gotta save up the gems again for blue lilia boy because boy blue lilia is gonna be crazy but anyway uh, that is gonna be it for this video like i said let me know what you guys are doing let me know how you guys are grinding um and let me know how you guys are getting on with the grind and uh what your sets are looking at and if you're gonna be on point to like have a full ssr set on all your main team uh once the event finishes man because that's that's ideally the point that you want to be at when this event finishes you know? but anyway uh thank you guys for watching the video man it's been your boy killer bz i'll catch you guys on the next one man peace